Hi, everybody. I'm Merc Music, and welcome back to Black Ops 4. It's very hard. Today, I'm actually going to be testing out what could be a brand new mini series where I use different guns in Black Ops 4 and try to hit quad feeds as fast as possible. The rules are pretty simple. I get to play five different game modes for three minutes each, and I have to try to hit a quad feed in three minutes. If I can't hit a quad feed in three minutes in the game mode, I have to leave the game and try again in a different one. Oh. Andrew joined. I have to let him know I'm recording. <laughs> and if I straight up just can't hit anything while recording, then I'll have to show you guys one of the quad feeds I hit for the quad feed with every gun video. The first game that I'm going to attempt is Hardcore Domination. So let's look for a game. Alright, we got Slums from Black Ops 2. This should be pretty good. But how can I be so rude? The gun we're gonna be using is the Maddox RFB. It's the last assault rifle you get. I think I'll just wait until the second half to start this. Once this half starts, we're going. And go. Alright. So, there's a lot of different reasons why I'm doing this whole, like, little mini-series. It's partially so I can have more time to go for quad feeds for the quad feed with every gun video, and also, you know, record something brand new and get a video out for you guys. Also, that was really unlucky. Um, oh my- Black Ops 4 spawns, there you go! But yeah, um, it's mostly for that. Uh, it's also so I can get more content out for you guys and get some longer videos going because, well, I think on average- Oh my goodness, that was horrible. I also haven't warmed up. This is my first game on, so this is going to be pretty rough, but it's also so I can get some longer videos out for you guys as well, because if I'm doing five different game modes for three minutes each, then I can get some more gameplay out for you guys, get some longer videos going. I've seen a lot of people asking for that, so yeah. I think I should probably maybe shut up for a little bit and start focusing. Otherwise, I'm not going to have anything hit. There were three people there B. Okay. This is pretty rough start so far. This is the Maddox RFB, the last assault rifle. I haven't used it since the beta. I don't have any attachments, and as I'm sure you guys have learned, I died from a fucking barricade. <laughs> um, as I'm sure you guys have learned from playing Black Ops 4, you probably already realized that attachments are very necessary to doing well in the game. As you get more and more attachments, it gets easier and easier to hit clips and just kill people, so going in here with a, uh, you know, a weapon you haven't touched yet with no attachments is going to be very difficult, but as far as it goes for the guns that are still left for the quad feed with every gun project, this one is probably not going to be as hard to use, so I figured I'd give that a try. Looks like we're, we can't get through there until that barricade's done. So I'm going to have to blow that up. <sighs> Come on, he's just going to free fire. Is it done? Is it dead? Is that barricade gone? I hear a dog. DOG! Okay, <laughs> that is terrifying. The dog got me. It ended up eating my butt. I can't say any other words because it's not family friendly. But yeah. Although, I, I dropped an F-bomb though, you know? This is a, a good start, five to nine. I should also probably have an out where I can leave a match if it's completely horrible. That hasn't happened yet. But, I don't know. Brand new series, so I gotta work out different things. I see them just standing around. Oh my god, he was there in the middle? Okay, so that, that's our first triple feed. Not bad. How, I have 37 seconds? Something like that, roughly 30 seconds left in this match. Oh god. You know, I really like hardcore domination on slums too. That is a bummer. I don't... Oh my goodness. Yo, calm down. Oh my goodness. Well, at least I'm getting some attachments going into other game modes. I'm probably gonna mostly stick to hardcore. Because, you know, it's gonna be a little bit easier to hit feeds and stuff. It's what I'm mostly playing. It's what I like, so... Oh my goodness. So we hit it before... What a choke! What an absolute choke of Miss Blokemus. I think I have like a couple seconds left, so... Yep. Oh, yep. I'm quitting the game. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to keep my attachments now. I feel like if I could have stayed in that lobby, I might have actually had a chance for a quad feed. So I don't know if this series is gonna do more harm than good. I did get my attachments, okay. So that was our first game mode. Now we're gonna be going into Hardcore Team Deathmatch. Let's find a game. Here's some the game chat. Ugh, what are these voices? So loads into a game and goes, mm. Mm -mm. This isn't a five-star restaurant meal. This is Black Ops 4. Mm -mm -mm. This is quite a tasty man. I, I gotta level up on this shit. It's getting low frequencies. What is that voice? Boy. All right, and we are officially starting in now. Clicking, I clicked the button. It's going. Hey, All right, three minutes. Three minutes, Eric. Can you do this? Can you hit a, a feed with the RFB Maddox thing? Oh god, got up there. See if I can get the flanky poo on the people up on the stairs. Hi. All right. Do I have to walk around here? Come on. Dude, okay, so I think the, the dealio, the Maddox RFV, is that it has a really good hip fire. So, and that's really good for hardcore because then you don't have to aim as much. Hello. I'm just bouncing all over the place. Dropping them. We're at, what? What? I wasn't zero to one. Oh, that was, it was, it was hovering over someone else. My bad. So I started off five to zero. 
pretty noise. But, gotta hit a feed. And see, that's why I like playing Hardcore Domination, because people bunch up more. I know that the spawns can be pretty bad sometimes, and, uh... The lo oh, God. <laughs> the lobbies might not be as good, but... We have noticed that, like, from all of our time playing, Domination and Hardcore Domination have been the best for feet and stuff like that. Even Control as well in Core. But we're mostly doing Hardcore Domination. And if you play, like, Hardcore Team Deathmatch or Hardcore Kill Confirmed, it's a little bit more casual, because I think newer players find the game mode. And they don't play as much Hardcore Domination for whatever reason, but... I thought I heard someone. Oh god. Woo! They put... Why? Oh, Razor Wire sucks, dude. But yeah, we found that newer players typically, they play Team Deathmatch, Hardcore Kill Confirmed, so... Dude, I'm smack -roni. Serving up some smack and cheese! For breakfast. Breakfast? Who eats smack and cheese for breakfast? I don't know. Um, we are- I <laughs> got a minute left, uh, I'm trying to do as much as I- I forgot I'm playing Recon. <laughs> oh no, oh no, not the Shock Drone. The Shock Drone always goes to me, dude. Just goes right for my obese cankles and traps me and I can't do anything. I can't hit any clippy poos and I'm just really sad. Lackamus of Stoinkamus. Doinkamus is not bueno. That, that, those are all words. Don't look them up in the dictionary. <laughs> but yeah. Ah! Okay. We got roughly 40 seconds left, less than a minute. Um, I'm not sure if this is a good map for hitting quad feeds, to be honest. I haven't played it too much because usually when we see it, we just don't play it because we know it's not good. <laughs> but I think Andrews hit a doinky on it. I got close to hitting a doinky with the Mozu. I almost hit a quad feed with the Mozu on this map at the start of the game, and it didn't go so well. So, yeah. But I'm not gonna... That's not gonna be the clip I show if I can't hit a quad feed today. I'll show something else, I don't know. I'll figure out whatever it is and then it'll be in the video. If I can't hit a quad feed, which, let's be honest, I, I am dropping them, but I don't think it, I'm blopping them hard enough. I don't think it's quad feed potential. Maybe in hardcore Dom. Ah! Oh my, okay, that was the alarm. That scared the man out of me. All right, let's quit. I'll take off the launcher and I'm gonna put fast mags on. Our third game mode is going to be hardcore kill confirmed. Let's find a match. And we are going, start of the timer. So, I'm not sure if you guys might have noticed this, but I think in Hardcore Domination, things were a lot more hectic. It was harder to actually keep up and do well, but there were more clip opportunities where in Hardcore Team Deathmatch, I think it was just generally easier to do well. So, that, that's probably going to be the case here in Kill Confirmed as well. Also, I hear shots, but I don't know where they're coming from. And, yeah. That's probably going to be the case here in Kill Confirmed as well. Where, there you are. I wonder where that guy was. I wonder if they'll spawn back here. Eh? I hear shots. Fast max is pretty nice. I like that fast reload. We're winning this. Alrighty. Woo! The hit markers on the other dude. Okay, I, I couldn't retract that dude. Yes, and I'm playing recon because in hardcore, if you shoot that thing, you can get a little mini UAV for yourself. I mean, you don't see people popping up only if they're in the radius, but it does let you have a mini map until it gets destroyed. Or if it expires. I think it expires, too. Oh, goodness. Where'd the other dude go? Did he just run away? Maybe come back. Nice. I got quick draw unlocked. That'll actually be pretty helpful. Because in hardcore, you either have to be hip firing first to drop people, or you have to be aiming faster, so. Quick draw is very helpful. I noticed that for a lot of weapons, you unlock quick draw a lot later than you typically would in COD games, which is interesting. I think they did that on purpose because they realized how effective quick draw can be. So they're like, you know what? For some guns, you get it at level 9. Which is ridiculous. For this one, it's 5. That's not too bad. Oh, goodness. I don't want to shoot down UAV or shoot me with that. That's not healthy. Come on. Boy! I don't have a lot of time. I'll counter theirs and I'll call mine in. Come on. No, don't do this! Don't take down our UAV! They did. They're gonna take down everything. Okay, okay. We got like roughly a minute left. And it's jungle. I don't know. I want to hit a feed. Come on. It's basically just me trying to be as aggressive as possible in any game mode for three minutes. I'm hoping I can hit a clip somehow. And then stuff like that happens. You know, I, I didn't even really hear that guy. It's interesting. I wonder how he got me. Okay, there was a second person there. But yeah. What? They have a special kind of radar? What? Oh, lightning strike radar, okay. 
Gotcha. Let's see. I'm trying to push in here, but I don't know. I don't think a quad feed's gonna be possible on this. But since this is my first time doing this, I will take some suggestions for different game modes as well because, you know, I'm going to stick to hardcore because that's what I like and I know I can hit feeds on it pretty consistently, but if you guys want to see me play a different game mode, you can suggest it in the comments. Oh, goodness. How to spawn? There it is! Was that a quad feed? Was it on screen? Oh, I don't think it was on screen! Ah, oh, it was a fury kill. Shut up, phone! Dude, that was so close! Oh, man, I really... I, I'm going to have to watch that back later and see if that was on screen. I don't think it was, though. I'm... I'm, I'm Ah, I'm very upset about that. Rules are rules, though. I gotta quit the game. Gotta leave. I'll sub out Lightweight and put Quick Draw on. I think I'm also gonna have to change the body armor for Core. Our fourth game mode is going to be Control. Let's find a game. And control. here we go. We've got some Gridlock Control. We're gonna be attacking first, which is actually very interesting, because sometimes attacking and defending it can make all the difference in your clip potential, depending on what map you're playing. I think attacking is decent. I don't know how the RFP is going to be in Core, though. I haven't been playing all that much Core. We do a little bit of Control here and there, but... It's mostly just been hardcore, as you guys probably Superior very... Oh. Why did everyone just say that wasn't very family-friendly? Okay, well. Could have been a little triple potential there, but yeah. Let's go over here to B. I think they're really stacking B right now. Oh, God. Gotta deal with that. That's the other thing, too. So in hardcore, you don't actually have, like, a little stim thingy to be able to heal yourself by default. You have to run stim shot, which is very interesting. So, when you go back to core... You have all this extra health and stuff, and you have to reheal. It, it, it's kind of tedious. I don't know. And it's interesting because I feel like there's going to constantly be different debates in Black Ops 4's multiplayer, whether that boils down to the health or the armor or the player counts, especially. Like, in my friend group, especially, and just like, I'm, I'm pretty sure online as well, a lot of people have a lot to say about 5v5 and how that's predominantly what you're going to be playing. And I, I'm gonna be honest, um, I feel the exact same way. It's just like, I feel like some of these maps are way too big for 5v5 play. I know that they're trying to go for this whole competitive kind of thing for Black Ops 4, but I just don't see it really panning out because Call of Duty is, you know, it's always been a really casual shooter. And I don't know, I, I don't see 5v5 really holding our attention for all that long after we're done with quad phase and stuff and the multiplayer starts to slow down a little bit, so. Also, they are stacking the hell out of B. There's definitely some potential here. I only have a minute, though, so I don't know if it's going to be possible, but, you know, we'll see. Just got to focus up here and see if anything can be done. Ah, see, then you got to reload. Taking B, though. Going to try to help this team before I have to dip, so. We have a head glitch over here. He likes to camp it up big time, doesn't he? Oh my god, all my shots were going through the door of that truck. They couldn't actually go through and kill him. And we got roughly 40 seconds. Don't have a lot of time. Maybe we could win this round at least. Do something nice for the team. Ruin out! I'm, I'm just spraying. That, that was trash. Horrible. Garbage. Pretending like you didn't even see it, although you have to. And we have roughly 30 seconds. Got to push in to be either we're going to take this. Maybe I can hit a clip. Who knows? Maybe not. Got to go for it though. Come on, guys. Our efforts gotta be better than this. Come on, come on, come on. Almost locked onto that guy. Almost had a triple feed out of it. Core is definitely gonna be harder. I think hardcore might be the way to go for uh, for most of these game modes, but oh well. I think we're pretty much out of time here. I should have an alarm flaring in my ears right about now. Okay. Well, we eliminated him. Did it. Shut up, phone! It won't turn off! Oh my. Alright, it's dead. Alright, we're gonna put the stim shot on because guess what? Our fifth and final game mode is going to be hardcore search and destroy. Yeah, I know what you're thinking. This guy's an idiot. Why is he doing hardcore search and destroy? There's always that chance at the start of a round you could just drop an entire team. Slums is one of those maps, too. I've gotta really make it happen now. Let's go. Starting off on slums. Okay, they only have four people, so I'm gonna have to kill all four of them at once in hardcore search and destroy. This is gonna be possible, you know? This is, this is a common thing. I do this every single day, blindfolded, while I'm sleeping, so. Shouldn't be a problem. Okay, well, one person's dead, so there goes the dream. But I'm still alive. Not out of this. Got another person. Maybe we can start the next round really quickly. A bonus to whoever frags their last man. Are you going to frag the last man? Ew. Did they plant B? Oh, we win. Awesome. All right. So I'm going to... Uh, in between rounds, I'm going to pause the timer. Because... Yes, I think that's fair. Okay, 225 is where we're paused. That guy just team killed. Hopefully they have a fifth person connect. Otherwise, this is going to go very poorly. Your boy Boochester got the play of the game. Why am I pausing this, actually? That's really weird. I shouldn't have paused that. Oh, well. 
I'm just gonna restart the timer. <laughs> and they have a fifth person. Okay, now this is gonna be good. Okay, well, now we're actually officially starting. This is the official timer. It's not gonna pause, nothing like that. We're just gonna go. I have to be as good as I possibly can. So, no breaks. Oh, okay, good start. Just getting picked off by an ICR. All right, awesome. And we get to watch, oh, maybe watch this guy hit a quad feed with his thermal LMG, gross. Okay, gonna have to deal with this for a whole year on Black Ops 4. He has hack in his clan tag. That's adorable. Hunting for deer? Is he hunting for deer? No, he's just staring at a wall. Great. Let's watch someone who is actually moving. Cryptic Viper. He's kind of moving. Okay. Maybe he can pull off something. There's only two people alive, though. Okay. Well, I'm definitely not going middle again, that's for sure. That's a big mistake. This dude is probably going to camp on him super hard and get the kill. Maybe. We have two minutes left. Come on. Hurry this up. Get, get this last kill. One tango I have one left. round left. Take him out. Oh, boy. Oh, he's right there! Charges dropped. What? Why? Oh, come on, dude. Just push him. This isn't some intense, hardcore search and destroy gameplay. Ay, ay, ay. You know, it's interesting because, like, me going for a quad feed and search and destroy, I'm going to play as aggressively as possible. I don't even care about what happens. I'm just trying to get as many kills. You don't see too many people actually play like that in search and destroy, so. I don't know. Maybe it's actually possible to hit clips. I don't know, because. You know, I don't think anyone really thinks to go for clips in hardcore search and destroy, or search for that matter, so. Unless you just play a lot of search, I don't see it happening. This dude's maybe gonna go for the plant. Yes. You got this, man. I'm gonna watch your back. Oh! If you play in a party, isn't that kind of like, you can give callouts, like from behind? <laughs> That's pretty bad. Oh, goodness. We did it. Awesome. Alright, so we have one more chance. Pretty much at the start of the next round, and then that's it. I think that's pretty much going to be over. So, I might have to reveal to you guys uh, one of my quad feeds that I've hit. So, that's the play. Beautiful play. Camped on him so good. All right. We have roughly 50 seconds left here. This is pretty nerve-wracking. I, I, I had a feeling I was going to get a team kill right there. Like, they're just going to shoot me. That would been hilarious, actually. <laughs> okay. Nothing there. I'm gonna try to go up the middle, and he blew up his teammate. Nice. Okay, I don't know where you came from, but I hate you. I, I severely despise you. Good God. Well, that not only just raised my blood pressure, got my heart racing, and I probably have a little bit of brown stuff in my shorts. But no quad feed. I, I think I could just end the timer early here because that's all I'm allowed. So. Quit the game, it's over. Well, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this little mini series that I've started trying to go for quad feeds with different guns on Black Ops 4. I am going to have to rewatch that clip on Jungle because I'm not exactly sure if I actually hit an on screen quad feed. If I did, then there's no bonus clip, and if I didn't, then enjoy this quad feed right now. A lot of them are going to be. Oh my god! Oh! oh. What'd you do? I got, I got the quad, quad with the sniper. But again, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this Black Ops 4 video. If you guys did it and you want to see some more Black Ops 4 stuff, make sure to drop a like, and I'll see you guys later. Mother